<laughs> What's up guys? So today is gonna be a little bit different. Um, I kind of want to switch it up and I want to take you guys on a couple days of what it's like to be a customizer and a YouTuber. But I also want to do this because I feel like I'm still really bad at vlogging. I know it looks like I'm not the worst vlogger, but I want to personally improve on my vlogging. I still feel really awkward when I vlog. I still never know what to say. I never know what to talk about and I've been wanting to kind of have an outlet to talk to people because I talk to like my friends and my family about customizing and just like custom work and stuff like that but to be honest you know no one really is gonna care as much as you guys because you guys are my family you guys are my YouTube fam um, and also you guys are into like the whole custom you know stuff so I've never really had an opportunity to talk to you guys and actually have you guys like get to know me and kind of you know spend a personal level with you guys so we get impersonal today just letting you know so I feel like I've just been really really blessed this past couple weeks or this month actually I just finished up a big order for Tyga which was amazing that was a big deal to me like that was really really special to me this week we are going to be doing something equally as special because I'm going to be knocking out two pairs of shoes for Waka Flocka, which is also a very big deal. Um, I have one more artist this week that I'm going to knock shoes out for, but I don't want to say his name yet because I want to finalize everything with him and I need to talk to his manager and get everything set up. And then also today I'm going to be working on a fragment order. Right now I'm going to head over to Michael's to pick up some products and then after that we need to pick up Waka Flocka shoes. And that's what's crack a I already don't know how to transition to the next clip, so I'm just gonna do one of these. I'll see you there. And if I had a dollar for every time I've entered Michael's, I would be so rich. <laughs> oh my god, I have so much stuff. All right, first location down. I'm gonna go get some shoes. Okay, so one of the pairs of shoes that he wants is a pair of custom slides that I make. So I'm gonna get them at Big Five Sporting Goods and you know, I'm just browsing online and I can see that they are on sale for $19.99. So if Dem Tings ain't $19.99, I am about to whip my phone out real quick. Someone better give me a deal right now. I swear to God, if I don't get this deal. When that sale comes through. The last thing I need is a pair of Vans, so I'm gonna head over to the mall and get some right now. All right, just got them. And no, we out to go start executing on some custom. I already know these old school ones, the Ferrari ones that he wants, are gonna take the longest because painting this panel red is like, I don't know why, but it takes so effing long. We're back at the crib and first order of business is these storm blue ones, which I'm gonna turn into fragments, but the customer said that he wanted to keep the storm blue. So I'm not gonna paint it a, a royal blue. I'm gonna leave it this blue and I'm just gonna paint the rest of it as if it was a fragment. So, so far what I have done is just the wings logo and then I'm probably gonna tape off this entire panel and then just continue painting it like a frag. So that's what I'm gonna do next. I have all of these Snups customs that I just finished. I still need to spray them with the um, finisher. That's actually why I got the Krylon. But yeah, I just needed like a quick finisher. So I'm gonna spray all these. So I have Waka Flocka's shoes. As I mentioned before, he said that he wanted um, some of the Ferrari customs that I made, but I just needed some old tools for that. So. I'm gonna get started on these as soon as I finish the Storm Blue custom. Yeah, and then I'm gonna do the sandals and it's lit. So we're gonna have a busy day today and we're gonna see how much we can get done. both pairs and these actually came out really clean I actually really really like the storm blue like I didn't expect it to look like this I thought it was gonna be a lot darker but looks pretty good so I'm pretty happy with the result uh, the only thing I need to do now is just 
spray both of them and then spray all the snup shoes and then I'm done. All right, the best part, time to get the shoes sprayed. This is my favorite part of doing the customs, but the fumes, whoo, the fumes are intense. So we're gonna take this outside. I just have all the shoes lined up. This is the lineup to get sprayed. Uh, we're gonna do a couple coats of this Krylon matte finisher. So the crazy thing about this product is sometimes when you use this, your shoes will get like super just foggy and crusty and disgusting looking. I'm sure it's happened to some of you guys with this product. I'm not sure if it's like the way that you shake it up, but I've had bottles where they were brand new bottles. I shook them up really well and it still gave my shoes this kind of like foggy, dusty look. I don't really know how to describe it. You guys just witnessed me pick this bottle up, so... Girl... But, um, you guys witnessed me just pick this bottle up, so... This is a brand new bottle. I'm gonna shake it thoroughly, and if it doesn't work, then... I'm gonna show you guys what I'm talking about, but... Brand new bottle. Just, just letting you guys know, brand new bottle. Let's go! Yo. I think I have the loudest cat, like, of all time. I think I have the loudest cat. There's been times where we've let her outside and the neighbors have literally complained. We've had multiple complaints from neighbors that she's so loud, but we can't keep her in the house for that long because she's literally so loud and all she does is meow. We give her all the attention in the world and it's, like, never good enough for her. Um, so yeah, there's been a couple times where the neighbors have complained, they've like brought her back, they've complained to the management that there's this like loud ass cat outside. So don't mind her, she's just super loud and needy. Um, but yeah, so anyway, we're gonna spray these shoes and we're gonna see how it turns out. It definitely did what I was talking about. If you can see like in this area, it looks like whiter or like kind of has like this like white residue and it just looks super like ashy and like just I don't know I don't know if you guys can see it on camera maybe this isn't the best lighting yeah you see like that kind of like white residue on that panel yeah so probably never gonna use that product again all right so since that just happened we're gonna have to do a whole new layer of paint unfortunately but they were looking crusty af and i'm not gonna give the customer some dusty ass shoes so let's fix these shoes and this time let's use some angelus matte finisher I got all these orders done and ready to ship out. So unfortunately, this is all that I can do today because I actually have to go somewhere, but we're gonna get working again tomorrow. So I will see you guys then. What's up guys? Day two of this work vlog. I'm having a bad hair day, so this is the current situation. You guys are my YouTube fam, so I feel like I can just like be myself around you guys, like hooded and all, you know? But what do I have to do today? I have, I think I'm gonna do two pairs of shoes today. I have, this order and then I have another big order that's coming in and then I have another couple orders that I just got yesterday but those aren't coming for a while so today we're gonna try and knock out two pairs that's what we have going on today um do I have anything else to tell you I had a really big stomach ache today when I woke up but I feel better now all right so besides that let's get to work <laughs> Our dilemma with these is that when I do the Ferraris, painting the side panel red is gonna take me like forever. I'm telling you, it's gonna take me like half the entire day. So I think what I'm gonna do this time is I'm gonna airbrush it because I usually do it with a paintbrush. So I avoid airbrushing at all costs because I hate taping panels off. Like I completely hate taping any type of panels. So I think um, this time I'm just gonna airbrush it. I'm just gonna go for it. So it's gonna be my first time attempting this and I'm not even gonna lie, I'm a little scared as always. I'm always scared to do customs just because I do mess up. I just, you know, it's all kind of like a learning experience. So I do mess up and I learn from my mistakes, but I just, I don't know. I don't want this to be a mess up. If I do mess up, you guys will definitely witness it. So yeah, let's see how this goes. <laughs> This failed me pretty much. Um, I got this one to look a little bit white, but it's just not the texture that I want. I think with the airbrush, the coats are just way too thin. And my airbrush just started going in and out and not spraying very well. So 
I'm just gonna go in with the paintbrush on both of them and it's funny because I tried to save time by airbrushing but I just wasted like double the time doing this and uh, the fact that I'm gonna have to go in with the paintbrush and do this is probably gonna take me the rest of the day to paint these panels red so it's looking like we're not even gonna finish these today and it's looking like we're only gonna be able to work on one pair today but mistakes happen it's good so let's start working <laughs> Jesus Christ, I finally got the panels red. Um, it is 11 o'clock at night. <laughs> I took some breaks in between, like some long breaks in between doing these, but it was five o'clock when I started and it is 11 o'clock at night. And this is all that I have done right now. And there's a ton of more stuff to do on these. So just giving you an idea of how difficult it is to paint these panels red. Oh girl, sold something on eBay. So super long time. But this is all I'm gonna do today. I'm super exhausted. So I'm gonna throw in the towel on these and I'm gonna start again tomorrow. Good morning guys, day three. So today is gonna be kind of like a shipping day. It's gonna be pretty chill. So let me take you and show you guys my progress on the Ferrari shoes and the slides. And let me show you what else I'm shipping out today. Hours and hours and hours later, I finally finished the Ferrari shoes. So this is the final outcome. And all I have left to do now is work on the slides, which I don't think I'm gonna show you guys the process of doing that just because I think I'm gonna make a separate video on that and yeah so flash you let's go the slides are pretty much done i just need to take this part off and then attach these but that's not very time consuming that's gonna be super quick so those are basically done today is like shipping day so i'm gonna be shipping out just some packages and then i'm gonna be shipping out all of these as well as the storm blue custom so these are actually going to some other youtubers so one pair is going to richie lee uh, another one is going to tony d2 wild and Another one is going to Blake Linder. So if you guys are familiar with those people, shouts out to them. That's pretty cool that I made these for them. But yeah, so that's what we have going on today. And then I have another order coming in, but I'm not sure if that's gonna be here today. So we're just gonna ship for today. So yeah, let's get started on that. like the next order just came in of course more vans boxes a couple pairs of vans of course so i'm actually not going to show myself working on these because i believe they're supposed to be a surprise for someone so i don't want to run anything i'm not even going to show this so i'm going to end the vlog here i'm going to need you guys to stop what you're doing right now and pause the video and go comment below if you like this style of video. If you like this video, if you like what you saw, let me know. Uh, it was a fun video to make. I enjoyed it. So yeah, let me know. Other than that, thank you guys so much for watching and peace out. <laughs>